In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you my simple product research method that I use to find winning products to import and sell on eBay. Then I'm going to show you a real product that is generating thousands of dollars in sales every month, one that I would actually recommend importing. So make sure to stick around. G'day guys, my name is Samson, I'm a full-time eBay seller, and in this video I'm going to be answering one of the most common questions I get asked about my eBay business, and that is how do I find winning products to import and sell on eBay from sites such as AliExpress and Alibaba. Today I'm going to show you step by step how anybody can find winning products on eBay using the Terapeak research tool, import those products, and then sell them for a profit on eBay. Yes, you can use this method for eBay dropshipping, but myself, I use this method to buy products in bulk and then resell them onto eBay. So guys, I'm not gonna drag this out and waste any of your time, but if you do find the video informative, please make sure to drop a like and also subscribe to my channel if you're new because I make two videos every week about selling on eBay and making money online. So let's get right into it. All right, I'm over on eBay now, and as I said at the start of the video, not only am I going to be revealing this product research technique, but at the end, I'm gonna be showing you a product that's generating thousands of dollars in sales every single month that actually does fit the criteria for a winning product. So for product research, I actually use the Terapeak research tool. Now, this tool is free with an eBay store subscription, but if you don't have a store subscription and just have a regular eBay account, you can pay for Terapeak $12 a month, and then you can use its features. However, if you're serious about selling products on eBay, I do recommend getting a basic store. Okay, so today I'm going to be teaching you something I like to call the funnel technique, and don't worry, this doesn't have anything to do with Lamborghinis or getting someone to buy a course. I'm basically going to be showing you how to use the Terapeak research tool to narrow down into winning products to sell on eBay. So I first like to start with a broad niche. That could be pets, fitness, or cooking. It doesn't really matter what this broad niche is. It just has to be large enough to have a bunch of different products to choose from. Then I look for a specific product within the niche. So if you take cooking as an example, that could be some oven mitts or a cooking utensil. It really doesn't matter what to start off with. And then once I found my product, I use keyword optimization in order to find the specific SKU that I should be looking to import and also I get to know exactly how I should be listing this product up onto eBay. And the goal of using this funnel technique is to find products with a 40% or higher sell-through rate, meaning that they are very likely to sell when you list them up on eBay. 50% or more is preferable, but 40% is what I found to be the minimum to find a product that generates consistent sales. So I'm now going to go over to the Terapeak tool and show you how that looks in practice. Alright, so if you're unfamiliar with the Terapeak research tool, as long as you have an eBay store, all you have to do is go into your seller hub and then from research on the drop down menu click on Terapeak product research and then you will be taken to this page and using the funnel technique that I just mentioned I'm going to start with a broad niche and then work my way down into a specific product that I know will get sales once I import it so the niche that I'm going to be talking about just as an example in this video because obviously I prepared this ahead of time is video games and consoles it's an area that I have a fair bit of experience in and I definitely recommend you guys for your first products to import onto eBay choose something that you have some sort of personal knowledge or interest in because having an understanding of the products that you're selling at least at the start can really help you with the customer service side of running your eBay business. All right so within the category of video games one of the best things to import would be controllers and other similar devices because you can't really import video games due to copyright reasons and I know right now that Nintendo Wii consoles are selling really well so I'm actually going to make a search on Terapeak for Wii remotes. So first I'll select new here because I only want to see new listings fixed price also because I don't want to see any auctions and then just type in Wii remotes into the search bar and now scrolling down you can see that the sell through rate for Wii remotes on eBay is 26.56% which is really good but it's nowhere near the 40% that I would need to want to import this product and this is where I feel a lot of beginner importers get disheartened because it seems like you can't find a product that has a high enough sell through rate to be worth selling on eBay but this is actually where the final part of the funnel that I like to use comes into play and I'm going to show you how I implement it. So scrolling down, if you see here within the search term for Wii Remote, there's a lot of different stuff coming up, which is not really helping us narrow in to a product that we really want to sell. As you can see, there's a rechargeable battery station for the Wii Remote, the Motion Plus accessory, and then just the basic remotes to name a few. And it does seem to me that some of the best selling products also have the Motion Plus accessory. So simply, I'm going to add Motion Plus to my search to see if I get a better result. Motion Plus. 
and then I'm just going to click research again. And now, as you can see from this search term, the products I've found have a 47.2% sell through rate. And guys, these are not small numbers either because the top item has sold 237 times and generated over $4,000 in sales. So I think it is clear to me that this is a winning product, but I also reckon I can do one better. So another peripheral you can sell relating to the Nintendo Wii is of course the nunchuck that goes with the controller. So I'm going to change my search terms from Wii Remote Motion Plus to a Wii nunchuck. And then I'm going to research that term. And scrolling down, you will now see the products listed have actually a 63.27% sell through rate. Meaning if you were to create a competitively priced listing in this search term, you would have more than a 60% chance of generating a sale. That seems really good to me guys. And as you can see, there are multiple sellers doing more than $1,000 in sales. The one we saw before doing 4,400, one doing 2,000, one almost 1,000. And then this one down here actually did $2,200 in sales as well. In fact, this seller has actually been very smart because they've bundled up a bunch of different Wii accessories to generate more profit. And as you can see, they're selling one of each of the nunchuck, the case and the remote for $66.40. And if I click on the sales history here where it says 148 sold, I can see that in the past 24 hours, they've generated around $200 in sales, which is really good for a product like this. However, the key to seeing whether this product is even worth importing is obviously heading over to Alibaba and seeing how much I can import it for and whether there's going to be any profit margin for me. So that's what I'm going to do right now. All right, so I'm over on Alibaba.com and I'm just going to type in what I typed in onto the eBay product research page. And I'm just going to search for a Wii Remote with Motion Plus. Now, there's a bunch of different suppliers that are actually selling these and I would like to look for one with a minimum of three years trade history and at least a 4.5 star rating, which is what you can can find down here and I actually found this supplier with seven years trade history and a 4.6 star rating now this definitely isn't the ideal supplier because the price range is quite varied and with shipping you may not be able to make a ton of money with this supplier but the key that you have to remember is the price that is listed on Alibaba is definitely not the suppliers best price I've been able to negotiate with most of the suppliers that I've dealt with on Alibaba and you guys should definitely do the same because obviously these controllers would be profitable at seven dollars and ten cents per unit and and not so much at $14.04. If we go back to the eBay listing with the best sales history, you will see that they're selling the remotes for $22.69. So you'd really want to get your cost of goods, including shipping, down to around $10 at the most because you've got to remember that you have to account for shipping and eBay fees as well. But the winning product that I would actually recommend importing and selling on eBay is a bundle deal like this with the Nunchuck, the Motion Plus controller, and also the silicon case. And this is from the same supplier as we saw here, this seller has been able to bundle these up together for a total of $37.90 and has generated over $2,000 in sales all within the past month. So I can actually give my stamp of approval, my recommendation to import a product just like this one. Obviously, the main point of this video is not to tell you to import this one specific product because if everyone who watches this video did that, then I feel like you guys would price each other out of the market. The main point of this video was to show you the funnel technique that I've been using to find multiple products like this that generate thousands of dollars in sales. So if you are looking for other ways that you could sell this exact same product and generate a bunch of sales on eBay, there are actually quite a few weaknesses in the listing that is already generating thousands of dollars in sales. So I dare say that you could easily overtake this seller. The first one is the fact that this seller is actually based in China. So they're not a domestic seller. And if you're based in the same country in which you will be selling products, you will have an advantage over sellers like this. Second of all, they don't have 100% positive feedback, which is an area that you can beat them in. But the biggest problem with this seller and in turn their listing is that they do not have a customized eBay store at all. Their account name has nothing to do with electronics and they don't even have a custom store template. These are all areas where you can beat this seller and therefore start generating a bunch of sales and overtake them in eBay's SEO rankings. So guys, please do not think that just because this seller has a bunch of sales history, there's no way for you to break into this niche and start selling products similar to the one that I just showed you. So in summary, my very simple but highly effective eBay product research method is as follows. First, you decide the broad category that you want to sell in in your eBay store, and then you niche down to a specific product or group of products that you know you want to sell. And then finally, you optimize the keywords of your search in the TerraPeak research tool to find winning products to import and sell on eBay. Obviously, the second part of this equation is contacting suppliers on Alibaba and AliExpress, but that deserves its own video. And if you'd like me to talk about how I interact with suppliers on Alibaba, then make sure to drop a comment down below letting me know. Also, if you have any other questions about importing products,
products and selling them on eBay, or you want me to make a video on a specific topic, then make sure to drop that down in the comments. I respond to every single one, so make sure to put them down there. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like and also subscribe to my channel if you are new. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Bye.